So, how are the repairs coming along? Uh, I've done everything I can, but I'm missing some parts and can't move on. What kind of parts? A bit of everything. The thing is that I'm not looking for very precise models or anything. I can always adapt, but I'm still gonna need some more gear. Well, I hope we'll find everything we need in this area then. We ought to. So, how are the repairs coming along? Uh, I've done it, what? Uh, but well. we ought to. Kind of a regressive dish, isn't it? Hmm? Why'd you say that? Well, it's a lot of fat and carbs. You're usually more fine dining. Hmm, that's true. There's more if you want. Definitely. 18, 19, 20. Keep on going, my love, you're strong. 21, 22. You know I'm able to count on my own, right? Yeah, but I like to watch when you do push-ups. That way I feel like I'm participating. You could also do push-ups. <laughs> no. No need for that. I am naturally muscular. There's no such thing as naturally muscular. For real? Arm wrestle? <laughs> no. It's a trap. If I win, you'll complain that I hurt your arm. And if I let you in, I'll be hearing about it for weeks. Ding, ding, ding! Win by default. See? Naturally muscular. Okay. Where'd you stock the plants? Right... here. I'm not seeing any. That means they're all gone. What are you looking at? The distance between us and the apiary. I wouldn't expect it to change. Exactly. It's comforting. What's this rocky chunk got to say? Well, for starters, it says it's not a rock. Really? It's not living, is it? No. It's not mineral or organic. So, what is it? <laughs> Going straight to the hard questions. But that is not how science works. How does it work, then? First of all, you formulate a hypothesis. Then you build an experiment to test this hypothesis. You observe, and you learn. Okay, 
Then, what have you learned? That I'm lacking imagination regarding hypotheses? One thing we know for sure is that rust particles scatter immediately when in contact with flow. I'd like to observe this reaction more closely. You can do that next time. Right now, you should go to bed. Already? What time is it? No idea. But I know I'm sleepy. And I want my snuggles before I crash. <laughs> gotcha. All right. You can open your eyes. Surprise anniversary! Huh? <laughs> I meant to say surprise and then I thought, happy anniversary. I panicked. Whose anniversary is it? It's our anniversary. One month on Source. Already? Yeah. I mean, give or take a few days. It went by fast. Yeah. Remember the time we almost died crashing on this planet? And the time we almost died in an earthquake? Ah, and the time we almost died fighting that critter? I hope this is only the beginning. And that I'll have many more chances to almost die with you. Aren't you a charmer? So, are you gonna open your present? Well, our present. Sure, sure. Uh-huh. What is it? Fermented apple dews. I stuck them in the soaker tub to accelerate the process. I'm calling it apple brew. Hmm. Do you think that it's any good? Well, worst case scenario, we just wasted some apple juice. No big deal. Should we open it now? We can open it whenever you want. We just need to find stuff to repair the nest now. We just need... Hey! Isn't that Oink? That is definitely him! That's Oink! What's happening, big guy? Why are you here? You missed us, didn't you? I bet he felt lonely on his empty eyelid. You do realize that we can't take you along on our journeys, don't you? That would be too exhausting for you. But you can stay with us next to the nest if you want. <laughs> no funny business, though. What was that? Sorry, I forgot that we could drift in order to turn. some flow hiding underneath yeah weird it looks like a flow bridge that's begging to pop out like a budding flow bridge perhaps if we wait long enough or we could come back later fine with me
another thing from home. How many do you think Axanova built before they realized it wouldn't work? Two already seems like a lot. Throwing money around isn't exactly within the company culture. Neither is canceling a project for that matter. I'm not surprised that everyone remained discreet about this whole failed colonization business. I am surprised by the fact my mom has never mentioned it to me. I don't think Exanova wins colonization contracts on the regular. These buildings look kind of old. Your mom may not have been head of the company then. She may not have been with the company at all. Yeah, that's possible. Still, it's weird. Agreed. I guess we'll figure it out eventually. I know, right? Let me know when you want to lead, all right? Sure will.
So, what's the plan exactly? Walking right back to this dead end? What? This is the path we took when we were separated from the nest. There's nothing there. Ah, oh, Bloot. I might have been a bit distracted. Should we turn around then? Whatever works for you. It isn't ripe yet. to wait a little bit for it to grow. Are you okay? Enjoying the view? Definitely. Another one. gone full circle. Now we just need to circle all the way back around. Ugh, this is so frustrating. Is 
Sorry, I kind of missed my U-turn. We'll do better next time. them. bit slower you should take the lead my turn did we miss or did it break it broke Are you already hungry? 
I'm just looking ahead. <laughs> you know what? Walking is nice too. That way, you have time to enjoy all the little bugs crawling around. I'm not seeing any bugs. That means we're walking too fast. some more flow stuck underground. Weird. I'm sorry to say it. I can't go any further without eating something. Same here. We need to take a food break. Seems like that's the highest we'll get. That wasn't too far off. Look, there's another bridge over there. Ugh, I wanted to go all the way up. We'll have to lay off the apple dews then.
we're gonna get stuffed. Oh, did you feel that? What? Like a tremor. No, I wasn't paying attention. I hope I imagined it. This one is nice and ripe. Do we agree this thing does not look very natural? Yeah. It's probably satellite debris or a rocket propeller? This part of space is a real dump. I don't know. This stone circle around it still looks weird to me. This? These aren't stones. They're Briam's Mollus Molus. Bloofs, for short. Bloofs? Yeah, because when you sit on them, it goes. <laughs> I like. Huh. Oh. Huh. <sighs> <sighs> I think I could fall asleep right here. You? Ah, uh, you. <gasps> Who? What? I told you I'm not going back. Go bloot yourselves. You. It's me. I think you fell asleep. Oh, sorry. These bloofs are way too comfortable. You can't leave me here. <laughs> if we ever need to sleep under the stars, we'll know where to come. <sighs> if that doesn't get us back... We should have brought more f I told you! You're the one who packed our bag! What's your point? You know what we should have packed? A card game? My guitar! You... have a guitar? Well, yeah. Where is it? At my house. On top. Well, I guess these days I can't really call it my house. Or even say it's my guitar. I didn't know that you played. To be honest, I wouldn't really say that I play. My mother's had me take courses when I was little. I took him for two years, and then I got tired. I never touched it again. I even called it an old-timey instrument. <laughs> but... I don't know. Now, with the campfire and everything... Hmm, I wish I could pull it out. Oh, I would have played along on the harmonica. <gasps> because you play the harmonica? No. But since we're imagining things, let's just run with it. Yeah, you're right. I can already picture it. We could have founded a band. The number one band on Source. A Yuki! It's an anagram of you and Kay. Yeah, I got that. I was thinking more along the lines of... The Flow Phantasm. Very poetic. Isn't it? Why not? Bite the rust. <laughs> not bad. Mm, dual flow. Shattered. Where the heart is. A mare. Apple do stew. Oh, yeah. I definitely like that. We are so apple do stew now. We'll bring the house down.
We just need to find stuff to repair the nest now. We just need to? Drifting next time. It makes faster turf. She's avoiding us. Whoa. I'm not sure what his toy did to him, but I wouldn't like to be in its place. Hold on. Isn't that... What? Let's get a closer look. Doesn't sound like a good idea. Another bit of rust for your collection? Oh, cool. I don't have this one yet. Uh, you are not even letting me take a look. Like you. Another one.
Okay. It would seem that he's not gonna share his toy. What did I tell you? Cover me. Oh, he's too impervious. We should coordinate our attacks. Take that! Alright. Same attack on three. Three! Three, two, one. Go, go, go! I think we found the right technique. Got it! That looks bad. On your mark. Go, go, go! Ha! I'm sure he felt that. My shield is out! Ready? Now! You want some more? On your mark? Anytime. Let go, girl! Three, two, one. Go, go, go! Woo! Ready when you are. All set. Ugh. Are you all right? Awesome! Ready? Now! You know what to do. I'm on it. You? Yep. Saw that. Pow! Who's next? The end. You left this toy behind. That's not a toy. Looks like... Alien machinery. I can't believe it. We have proof before our eyes. There exists, or has existed on Source, a form of intelligence at least as evolved as ours. Kay? This is a historic discovery. This is... Kay! What? It's ours. What? It's a Draca. Drone for autonomous cartography. Very old tech. The kind we sent out to beauty before it was integrated to the apiary. Oh. Seems like they pondered integrating Source for a while as well. I wonder why they changed their minds. Could be the fact that this planet is scattered like a puzzle. Probably was a factor. The Draca may hold some answers. You're kidding. No, really. Stuff from that era was built tough. We may be able to boot it back up. Hmm. Mm. Okay. I might have spoken a bit quickly. The flow circuits are completely fried. But... But... but, 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 but look at what I was able to salvage. The anti-grav chips don't seem to be damaged. I should be able to make them compatible with our boots by tweaking the connectors a bit. Whoa. Even better, the mapping module is also working perfectly. If I plug that into the glove's power source, it should... Boom! This should be very helpful for finding our way around the bits of land. <laughs> you never cease to impress me. Ah, uh, that's nothing, really. These old machines are plain and simple astronautical engineering. Not like the new stuff with boronic nano components everywhere. So, that way we can map out the different bits? Yeah, and with this, we can make our way back to the nest a lot easier. Hey, look! It says there's another bridge in this area. Perfect. That way we can test if your thingy works. Better? Yes. Thank you. this. Ready when you are. 
All set? Uh, you! Ready? Now! I don't like this. On your mark, Lambo. Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. Great job. You're welcome. One to go. Shield up. Are you all right? You started it. He's right for the picking. Harvest time. You? Yep. Saw that. We make a good team. Can we go back the other way? As you wish. this Take it much longer. There's no way. One to go. I'll keep them at bay. This one's tough. Maybe try something else. Uh, you. <laughs> Why? You got ha. Now what? This Ooh, boom, baby. Ready when you are. Ready. You know what to do. I got this. It's right before the picking. Harvest time. Who's next? I have to say, it's much nicer this way. Less time doing U turns with good drifting skills. Ah! 
been there. Well, yeah, that's where we came from. No, wait. We just saw this one. The other bridge must be located a little higher. Higher? What does that even mean? Just look at what's on the radar. You can use these boots for drifting. It makes faster turns. Sorry. I'm still not completely used to this model. Right on! Seems like the radar is working. Are you surprised? This is weird. What is? It looks like there's also a pre-recorded location on the radar. Huh. What could it be? I don't know. Little Draca's favorite picnic spot? In that case, we definitely have to check it out. Who's a good oink? Who's daddy's oink? Who's that? Oh, you are! Yes, you are. Come on, give me your boots. Once I plug in these chips, they'll be like a whole new pair. I can barely figure out left and right as they are. I am gonna kill them. I swear I am gonna kill them. Are you sure you don't want to take a break, get some fresh air? No! These bloating anti-grav chips aren't the boss of me. I still don't understand what the problem is. The problem is, there is such a thing as a standard. And the Borons who designed this drone thought it might be fun to improve this standard. Except, if you take a standard and improve upon it, you get... Two standards? Zero standard! <sighs> And so now, it looks like I have to machine these boron chips. Just so they can fit in these bloating boots. Uh... Anything I can do to help? No. I'm okay. I'm done. What? But that was super quick. Well, yeah. When you have the right tools. I mean, since you were complaining, I was thinking that it would take a while. It's a matter of principle. Let's go. We'll see if these work outside.
Ready to test these bad boys? I guess. What are we doing? Okay, follow the thread as usual, except this time we should be able to make it till the end. Space, but floating a few feet above the ground is awesome? Uh, awesomeness is very subjective, you. In any case, these boots are working. We should try them with that thread we weren't able to use last time. Do you remember where it was? The mapping module certainly does. That means they're all gone. one-handed can you do a one-handed push-up one-handed push-ups are full of blued they're for show-offs okay but can you do it never tried as if you just can't do it I'm sure I could go ahead then do it no I told you it's full of blute I don't want to pop my shoulder or throw up my back your loss I mean I used to find the two-handed push-ups impressive but I'm starting to get used to them you'll have to freshen up
Do you want to see something new? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Ready? <clears throat> Back push-ups. Whoa! So, so strong. How could I possibly resist? No one's asking you to resist. That is true. so late I had an idea I wasn't able to go back to sleep so I went ahead and tested it want to hear about it uh yeah okay but real quickly because the only reason I'm awake is that I have to be all right so we figured out that rust was not a mineral matter nor was it organic matter so what else is left antimatter <laughs> correct I didn't even think of that. But no, if it were antimatter, we wouldn't be standing here talking about it. So considering that rust is neither mineral nor organic, nor is it antimatter, it could be flow. Cool. But you could have just asked me. You can tell it's not flow because flow is blue and all flowy. This is red and all hard. I'll have you know that I just completed the test and the rust molecules are precisely the same as those in flow. They're just organized differently. Kind of like water and ice, if you will, just not the same. That's why flow, in the form as we know it, has such a strong effect on the rust. The molecules are binding, unbinding, and... Yes, sorry to interrupt, but are you almost done? Uh, I guess that depends on how detailed an explanation you need. The least. Then I'm done. Okay, thanks. Gotta pee! Is there any way I can help? Nope. I'm almost done. Okay, but after that, for it to grow, won't we need to water them or anything? Not these ones. The soil looks sufficiently flow-rich for their needs. After all, they were already thriving when we got here. Does that mean we'll have nothing left to do before we have some fat homemade fruits? You could always sing to them. It helps. For real? No scientific study has ever proven the contrary. So... maybe? Do you think they'll like some... acrobats? It'll be your mission to find out. Thank you. 